Hello, and welcome back to Octopath Traveler. It's been a little bit. Um, yeah, so I thought I'd get another recording going. I leveled up quite a bit. Um, I also went and I grabbed while I was running around and grinding. Um, I grabbed what are they called? Secondary jobs. I didn't get all of them, I don't think. Yeah, I'm, I think I'm one or two short. Um, so, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, did I grab all of them? Yeah, yeah. Hunter, Thief, Apothecary, Dancer, Warrior, Nun, Cleric. Oh, I'm missing. Uh, wait, no. Hold on. One, two, three, four, five. None, six, his own. Okay, yeah, I'm missing at least one. Um, so I still need to heal, apparently. Did not go to the end last time. Let's just do that now. Yes. Then we're actually going to go back to not here. Instead of doing Cyrus's story going to try going back up to Victor's Hollow for Old Brick. See how that turns out. Probably won't be the best. Give it a go. Also, at the end of March, I'm moving back to the US. So videos will probably be really slow we're gonna skip a couple weeks of um, two or three weeks of D&D &D. I don't remember how long uh, but I'm al I also haven't posted last weekend's session yet gonna get to that probably next week actually I'm gonna have some days off next week and the week after that I have like all week off and then a couple days, work a couple days, and then my parents are going to be visiting Japan, and I'm going to be going home on the same flight as them. So during that week of free time, uh, I'm probably going to be doing more videos, like Let's Play stuff, editing things. Um, videos, of course, are easy to edit I uh, for the Let's Plays. Trying to get on these stairs. Do I actually have the ability to go on? Okay, I can go on the. Oh, I was just missing. Okay, doesn't do anything to go on the stairs. I don't have the thief with me. I've already. So I already did this. So it'll just tell me. Sharp spear, heavy axe, a fine bow, and a quiver full of arrows, despite the name I suspect. Speak against dark attacks, and I've yet to meet a man who didn't burn. So use fire. And regular weapons should be fine. Don't want to challenge him. Yeah, let's give it a go. Um, what's going to change when I get back home? Uh, I'm going to be looking for a job. So I might have less time to... Uh, do recordings uh, and what else I'm gonna have a, another computer to render so I'm gonna continue recording on the laptop because that's what I've been doing I'm used to it um, but I'm gonna have my desktop computer again and that's gonna be editing and rendering because it's just a stronger machine because it's got more when it's got more storage to um... actually the graphics card might be a little behind now I don't know, but um, I prefer doing editing on a desktop computer over a laptop. Uh, you don't, you need more power to do the uh, initial recording than you do to do the editing anyways, because you're re-encoding, it, it'll take longer regardless of your machine, so I prefer to record on the laptop either way. One, I'm used to it, too, if it's more powerful, good. Uh, and then the other thing is the internet 
that my parents have, which is where I'm going to be at first, is faster. So I'm going to be doing um, 1080 uploads instead of 720. The few times that I do upload. So I'm already recording in 1080. It's just it takes so long to upload with my internet that I haven't been uploading it in 1080. I read this dialogue the last time I tried doing this, so I'm just going to skip it. Can I? Yes, I can. Okay. Greetings. Are we hearing the game? Yes, we are. Okay. I'm going to mute my desktop audio just in case something goes off. On that, I'm louder than the game by quite a bit. That's fine. Uh, again, I'm going to skip it because I remember I did this dialogue once before. Gustav's defenses appear impenetrable. Oh, sorry. I'm playing a game here. There was a storm. I don't know. Let's try level slash. I'll tell me. Okay, yes, they are. I don't know about him. I see arrows on. Is this spear? Spear. It's weak to spears. I'm just gonna luminescence. Hit them all, that's good. Well, I know level slash does good. So I'm just going to level slash. Get rid of those guards as quickly as possible. The guard should be weak to fireball, right? Well, let's just try a regular fireball and find out. No, but he is. Okay. Not that it's affecting anything right now, because he has people up front. I'm level slashing more to get them to break than because it's dealing extra damage. Warrior skills, level slash. I'm gonna be using, uh, assuming I have enough SP, I'm gonna be using 1000 spears on Gustav when he's alone, but for now I'm just gonna do the regular bit. Level slash, okay. Not near as big of a problem as the last time I tried this. Let's see, what can I do with the pop carry stuff? Stand. Attack all foes with an axe, dealing damage inversely proportional to your current HP. Just below half. I don't know. That doesn't sound like it's good enough to, uh do when I'm at half health. Let's try an Ice Wind. See what these guys up front... Okay, they weak to Ice Wind. Alright. I'm gonna try powering things up. Deal some extra damage to the guys up front, maybe? A little hard to tell if that's actually doing any good. Ooh. Just gonna level slash with her. I'll heal her with Cyrus because he has a pot to carry now. I'll just max it. I don't know how much he heals. Okay, that was really good to max it. Alright, those two guys are gonna go. I think Gustav's gonna go. I wonder how many eggs he eats for breakfast. Uh, go ahead and level slash with you. And with her. Not, not that, that. I'm gonna cast Heal More with Ophelia. Just uh, heal up a little bit here. Okay, good. 
It's just going to use regular attack. That's also good. Should I? I'm going to use Blizzard. That hits them twice. Oh, she went again. Okay. Uh, well, let's just take them out of the equation for a turn then. Yeah, but I don't remember what it does. Brand's Thunder. It's really powerful. I want to save up for that, so I'm going to switch over to that. Nice, second serving. I'm going back to Luminescence. Right, that left shield warrior looks like he had less health. Or I was just getting higher rolls on him, that's more likely. Do another regular blizzard here. Right, that's not bad. That's not horrible either. Actually, let's go ahead and not that. Use a regular mossy meep. See who it decides to heal. I guess they were both regular Mossy Meeps, it's just that one only had one left on it. It's level slash. We're gonna use Heal More again with Ophelia. Top people off. And that's fine. Let's see. That's cost 30. I can use one more level slash. Go ahead and do that. Let's do uh, increased heal more. See if that... Oh, that didn't quite heal Hanit all the way, but that's fine. A little slash. That's not too bad. No, it might be bad, actually. Black Blade. Ooh. He's the Apothecary, though, so he can deal with that. Um, can spend five. There's no offensive ones. They use five. Let's hit that guy. I can't boost, but if I rehabilitate, I'll be able to next time. I'm also immune to status effects for a couple turns that way. All right, uh, do a regular luminescence then. See what he decides to do. Philia goes first, so that's fine. A level slash might take one of those guys down, maybe? No? Okay, fine. Whatever. That's, you know, we're fine. I'm gonna heal more. Heal more, not luminescence. At two points. Cyrus is... Oh, that's not Cyrus. What am I thinking? You try to take that guy down. Cyrus is going to max out and use Blizzard. So that he'll definitely take those guys down. There we go. can't thousand spears anymore we'll just hit regular spear then I <laughs> fly uh, we want to do a powered up version of that so we're just going to spear him a little bit here looks like you're gonna be using heal a lot And yourself with no one else. Let's see axes. Let's see if I if he's weak to axe. Good. Okay. Level slash. That's not the worst thing. Let my arrow fly. 
Uh, it would have been nice to get a second serving on top of that, but... Ooh, I think she's cursed. Just gonna do a regular heal more, then. We're gonna use one of those to make him not go next turn. Yeah, re rehabilitate will leave me enough to use full powered fireballs stuff next. Wildfire, whatever it's called, the powerful version of it. We're just gonna heal again with you. Top everyone off. Overfill you, that's good. What am I doing? Scholar skills! Firestorm! Warrior skills! Thousand spears! That did some decent damage. Regular attack with her. He's gonna be back, he's probably gonna... No, he only takes eight. Okay. I was afraid he would uh, boost his armor. Some enemies do that. Alright, Cyrus has this really cool thing from Apothecary, where he's going to start gaining SP back, but he doesn't deal enough damage for it to really be powerful. Um, let's see if he's weak to a dagger. Nope, didn't think so. I want to save Ophelia's uh, SP for healing. I don't think she can do her powerful heal anymore. I'm not sure. Oh, she can't. Good. Okay. Uh, in fact, I'm gonna have to use it now. Yeah. Okay. There we go. Second serving on that. You're going to want to use an Inspiring Plum on yourself. Let's try this. Good, there's the second serving. Oh, you're just going to go again. Yeah, second serving. It's very powerful. Um, I doubt you're weak to regular swords, but I'll... Yeah, I didn't think so. Just gonna hit you for a little more SP. Cyrus is gonna use Firestorm next, okay. It's a little annoying that Hanit got that, but... Uh, take a medium healing grape. Why don't you? I'm gonna firestorm at max. Deal some decent damage. Hit you with that a few times. Can't boost, but you can still knock him out now. Just because you happen to be going first. I'm gonna give you an inspiring plum as well. Get a few more turns out of you. Healing and whatnot. When I need it. Turn skills performed by a single chosen ally will trigger twice. This will not affect other divine skills. Cyrus. Victory shall be mine. You I want to attack with. You're going to use Inspiring Plum and Cyrus. This. 
Cyrus is going to firestorm and it'll trigger twice. Starting to go into a stance. Yeah, he's at 50% health. It was yellow. You're going to use another inspiring plume on him, so he's going to have enough for sure. I'm going to spear that dude. Firestorm, that's what's next. You're going to full power do that this time. I used fireball. I meant to use the other thing. Whatever. Too late now. Any more... Ice damage, wind damage, dark damage. What do I have here? Nothing that will be useful. Let's just hit him four times with your spear. That's pretty useful. Same here, just hit him four times. In with Firestorm. He's actually in the red now, so we might be able to do some decent damage. Holy Light. He goes three times now. Annoying, but I think we'll be fine. Wow, that does almost nothing now. No, I'll just use Firestorm. Nice, nice. There's second serving, perfect. Oh, and she's going again at the end. Even better. With the second serving. <laughs> okay. That's not any use. Take Gustav twice. Oh, I probably should have switched weapons. That's a horrible weapon. Well, hopefully Gustav death soon, but for now we're just gonna do fireball. I would have been very surprised if that killed him. It'd been nice if that did the extra attack there. Ulbrich's close to dead. Ulbrich's cursed. No, that does even less. Okay, we're going to break him this turn as well. I'm meant to go to item. Do your best to take him down. That's the most logical course of action. Nice. 
Nice. No extra turn, though. That would have been better. Another Black Blade. Cyrus doesn't have enough SP to do anything about that at the moment. How much damage does that do? 45? There we go. He's dead. Really? You didn't level. Then again, you leveled a lot recently, so. Spike shield and Gustav's shield. Hmm. Hope those are upgrades. Be weird if they weren't. Damn it. Curse my blade, but the victory is yours. He yields, he yields, all hail the unbending blade. A new king of the arena is crowned. Three cheers for Ulbrich Eisenberg. Huzzah, huzzah, huzzah. Did, did you see that, lads? The Black Knight fought bravely, but the unbending blade has won the day. He won. Did you see that, Ned? He won. Of course I did. I saw every blow land and me own wounds ache to just watch him. Are they actually? No, okay. A good fight. Aye, it was that. No shame in losing to the likes of you. On another day, you could have been the victor. Aye, mayhap, but did it... But today's your day, and I'll keep my word. When you're ready, come by my room at the end, and I'll tell you what what I know. As you wish. I will see you anon. Which I assume means soon. Because it doesn't mean anonymously. The bards will sing of this duel for years to come. All hail the new king! Hey, woo ye! I won, but I'm no closer to understanding why I wield my blade. Alright. Make for the inn. Run, forest! I mean, for it. That's what I meant, for it. I'll save here just in case. Ah, welcome. Make yourself comfortable. A deal's a deal. You want to find Earhart? I'll honor my side of the bargain. But let's take it slow. There's much we have to talk about, you and I. If you say so. But what about him? Sir Earhart, of course, and what I know of him. I'm listening. Now where to begin? Tell me, Sir Ulbrich, are you familiar with the land from which Sir Earhart hails? Some border it, the far reaches of Hornbeck. Or so he once told me. Aye, a peaceful village called Bryn. At least it was till it was raised in the war. <laughs> it was long before Lord Earhart became a knight that he lost his home. After that, he joined a band of Seltors for a spell. It was there he got an idea in his head. And so he finally came to serve Hornburg and the Crown. As a spy. <laughs> Preposterous. You mean to tell me that Earhart meant to betray us all along? His eyes always burned with fire when he told the tale. The King of Hornburg turned his back on us, he said, and sat on his ass as our homes burned. Nonsense. King Alfred cared for all his subjects. 
he would never. Lord Earhart claimed otherwise. Either way, he's a man on a mission. If that's true, that means he'd been plotting the downfall of Hornburg for years. Revenge is made all the sweeter by the passage of time. And sweet it must have been for him when Hornburg fell at last. I don't pretend to admire his deeds, nor claim they are honorable. But then, I've never known the pain and anguish where Earhart was forced to bear. Though I wonder sometimes how it made him feel to see justice done. If winning his revenge put his heart at ease. I never asked him, and he never told me. But of all the men in this world, I'm happy to tell you. You look up to the man, don't you? He taught me to be a true warrior. And I dare say he was a friend as well. I know of little else but the ways of battle. Whatever his sins might have been, I was proud to call him my brother. As was I. Thank you. Happy to have the company and a willing ear. You'll find Sir Earhart in the desert town of Wellspring. If you do, well, I trust you'll do what's right. Even if that means I slay him? Your friend, your mentor, your brother. If that is what you believe he deserves, I reckon he'll accept his fate. And so will I. Whatever the cause he fought for, it does not excuse his deeds. He slew the king he had taken a sworn oath to protect. I will listen to what he has to say. That much I can promise you, but no more. Hmm, interesting. Does Gustav have the right of it? Did Erhard wield his sword for the sake of revenge? If so, does he still wield it, even though the thirst for vengeance has been sated? Has Earhart, too, lost his purpose? Hmm. Interesting. Uh, I'm gonna heal up. <laughs> yeah, definitely need to heal up. Lots of monies, though. That's nice. Are they called, um, leaves? Lots of leaf? Alright, somebody else has a story here, then. We're ignoring the side objective still. Looks like something's gonna happen over here. That's the exit, okay. Hey, where are you running off to? What does it matter? The tourney is over. Our bargain is concluded. It is. But that doesn't mean we can't bid each other Godspeed. Phew. Got you in the nick of time. We won't let you go sneaking away without so much as a fare thee well. Of course. Pray forgive my manners. I could not have gotten this far without you. Both of you. You have my thanks. You have ours. So, if I can be so bold, where are you off to next? The Sunrise. A town called Wellspring. We finish where we start. And then? I don't know. Perhaps I'll return home. To the village I came from. You've already got a place to call home, then maybe this means nothing. But if you're looking for a new line of work, you could do worse than.
from being a full-time champion. <laughs> the offer is welcome, but it's not the right one. Thought you might say that, but I had to ask, huh? If you ever have a change of heart, drop on by. Or even if you don't, you'll always be welcome here. Thank you. Title and a crest, not a sword for me. Aye, true enough. Maybe I will go and win it all. <laughs> See what the betters will say about that. Tell you what, if they crown Ned King, you come back and we'll put on a duel the likes of which the city's never seen. I'd like that very much. But today, the road comes. And so did Ulbrich leave Victor's Hollow behind him, with new knowledge of Erhard's past and present. Now Ulbrich must find Erhard, and God's willing, the truth, even if it means crossing blades with this erstwhile friend. And so to the Sunlands and the desert oasis of Wellspring, Ulbrich's journey continues. And away we go. It's gonna go that way, I guess. Or uh, do everybody else's stuff, actually. It would make more sense. Rampant weed. Treant. It's nice to have two people with Arrow Storm. <laughs> really nice. Oh, I didn't check those shields out. I should do that. Equipment. Everybody has plate shields, so spike shields only really better for elemental defense. Really drops evasion by like what sixteen? Drops physical defense by only one. Okay, I like the evasion being high though. Makes the need for other defenses lower. Uh, okay, so where are we gonna go? We could go back to. The scholar's stuff. Uh, we're not going to do that yet. It's too high a level. That's level 27. That's level 38. Okay, so we have level 27 for the hunter. Stone guard. I've been close to stone guard. I don't think I went in, though. Um, level 24. We're definitely closer to level 24, so we're just going to fast travel back to Quarry Crest. How long have I been recording? 
40 minutes. Okay, we might be able to do uh, some story-related things. Let's uh, go find out. Mm, wouldn't hurt to heal up again. Maybe buy some items. I did equip quite a few upgraded items last between the last recording and this one. Because that was the main aim, was to get a whole bunch of gold. Or, not gold. A lot of leaf and uh, get better weapons and armor that way. Let's go ahead and sell a couple things. Why is that? Probably because it has such a high elemental defense. Let's see, not really better. A little better. Let's see, 60 better on that. She doesn't need elemental attack, so yeah, I'll, I'll get that for Haunted. Okay. I got any kite shield. It's definitely not that great. Really all I needed? That was all I needed. Okay, that's good. Wait, hold on. Physical defense is higher with this. Max SP drop, she's the healer. We'll leave her with what she has. Sell that arcane glaive. I'm gonna sell energizing pomegranates, I don't use them. Keep the soul stones for now. Don't need these anymore. And they're not worth very much, though. I'm gonna go back to a provisioner. Wait. Is that store on this side too, or is it back on the other side? Back on the other side, okay. I may have looted some chests too when I was exploring. Now that I'm looking at chests all over the place in town. Uh, of course, I was just trying to find good money. Okay, where is... Okay, that's the end. There we go, provisions. Let's get like five of these. Assume I can. Yes, okay. Got it. Medium olives of life. Don't need those. Not really. Wait, what? How much Nox root do I have? Wow, okay. Get rid of some of these materials that I never use as well. Let's buy... Five more of those. Ten of these. Eleven of these. It's the wrong button. Oh, I can only get ten more. Okay, that works. Mild hazardous substance of a large volume. Injurious dust. Okay, but what's do? Not telling me, so I'll leave it alone. I'm gonna save. Pretty sure nothing bad's gonna happen to this recording, but one never knows. Not really. All right, there we go. Cut same trigger. I'm not suffering from fatigue-induced hallucinations after all. 
That's good. It's me, Odette, in the flesh. Good to see you as hale and hearty as ever. And you're an insufferable bottle, no doubt. What are you waiting for? Come in already. Don't mind if I do. Did I know that would be your muse? We were practically joined at the hip back in the day. Just watching you go about so fun in and of itself. I always had a hunch you'd end up in trouble with the ladies, but to think it would happen with the princess of all people. Somehow, you've managed to exceed even my wildest expectations. By expelling me, they hope to protect Her Highness's good name. Needless to say, there's no truth in any of this. Oh, of course, of course. I'm sure it's all as you say. Her Highness and this Teresa are just good people. They have no romantic interest in me in the slightest. You're something else, Cyrus. But it's a relief to find your powers of observation are as keen as ever. Okay. Well, did you come all this way just to entertain me? If so, congratulations on a job well done. I like her. Save your congratulations for another time. I've come in search of a certain token. Are you perchance familiar with From the Far Reaches of Hell? A cheery title if I've ever heard one. I can tell you that it's a compendium of ancient rites and rituals. Not that I've read it myself, of course. I know that much. I was hoping you could tell me more. Not much more. It touches upon necromancy, I believe. Ooh. Oh. Necromancy? Necromancy. That said, of to what extent, I know little. I was sure that if anyone could enlighten me, it would be you. Give me a break. Is that supposed to be flattery? Alright, just give me some time. As soon as I tackle the little pickle I'm dealing with at the moment, I'll do some investigating. Oh. A pickle, you say? Consider my interest piqued. I always took you for the type who chewed up and spit out your problems before pickles they could become. Again, I find your flattery lacking. Anyhow, since you're here, perhaps I can put you to use. As it happens, a number of people have gone missing of late. Under suspicious circumstances, I presume? Just so. Many, quite literally, seem to have been spirited away. One soul went to the neighborhood provisioner to buy some foodstuffs and never returned. Another turned a street corner, only to vanish entirely, leaving his friend, who was strolling with him, in disbelief. Sorry, I keep hitting a button on accident. All told, ten men and women have gone missing in such a fashion in the past half year. Most intriguing. How curious indeed. <sighs> Don't look so disappointed, you nut job. So how about it? Do you have any ideas? Hmm. 
It would be imprudent to jump to conclusions without conducting an investigate. Great. Great, thanks. I knew I could count on you. Oh, there's no I. It's just knew I could count on you. I'll look into that tome while you're away. As you wish. A fair trade, I'd say. Though I dare say that having the opportunity to solve this peculiar puzzle is a reward in itself. I see. It figures. Well, happy investigating. Shoo shoo, go along now. Yes, I should ask Odette where precisely the kidnap fiends have occurred. Before that. Thank you. Thank you. Let's see now. Come to think of it, the three people who went missing were all last seen near the end. It could well be a coincidence. Right, they were all near the end, supposedly. What's my chance here? 64? Yeah, why not? Driven from her home by wealthy prospectors when the gold rush began, this woman hangs on her head. She jumps on the way to people will be more respected to your attempts to allure them. I don't have that character with me, thanks. System of underground canals runs all throughout this town. I don't think anyone has ventured down there in quite some time, though. The sewers. There's an entrance to the sewers behind the inn. Okay. Seen it happen both in the dead of night and broad daylight. Someone's walking by the inn, they turned the corner up ahead, and when I followed, they were gone. Vanished into thin air. Most intriguing. Indeed. Now then. And with that, I do believe I have all the knowledge I need to crack the case. Near the inn. Every victim was in the general vicinity of the inn when they disappeared. We can say with absolute certainty that they did not vanish into thin air, or some such nonsense. It's funny, because magic exists. At all hours. As such, it stands to the reason that they were kidnapped. Good, good. And that the kidnapper made use of a hidden path or passage to evade the public eye. The sewers. What? It's been the middle answer. Okay, whatever. The entrance to the sewers would seem to make for an ideal escape route. Yes, doubtless the culprit stole underground to spirit his victims away. And write an anime about it. Oh wait. Justly. I do believe I should have a look down there for myself. Yes. Agreed. Shall we, then? Sewer is level 24. Alright, that's fine. Oh, another cutscene. Here we are. Well, these aren't sewers. They're ancient ruins. What are you talking about? From the looks of it, these aqueducts predate the founding of the village itself. Is there an echo in here? There is a good chance many of the villagers are unaware of their existence. This calls for a thorough investigation. Call me Sherlock Gnomes. Oh, wait. That name's taken. But I must be wary. Cyrus Gnomes? No? No. Gnomes. Doesn't work. For all I know, the culprit could be lurking in the shadows as I speak. That's funny. You're thinking. 
I will proceed with caution. A sound plan. After all, it simply wouldn't do if I became our villain's latest victim. You might if you keep laughing. Oh, that's an inspiring plum that hits everyone. There is no choice. The undead rise to the occasion. Which is fine, because apparently I've fought skeletons before, so I have an idea of what's going on here. Must have been during some cave dive or other. I was hoping for more damage than that. Alright. Let's do some luminescence on these bags of bones. There we go. A level up would be nice. For anybody, really. So I can't tell if the way's over here, it's over here, okay. Let's see. Pretty sure the purple chest I can't open yet. Oh, it's a Wookiee. Arr. What the heck are those things? Wind Wisp. Lightning bolt. Lightning bolt. Oh, sweet. Perfect. Lightning blast. Why'd I do that? My throat is going to be, like, destroyed. <laughs> If I use Beast Lore, I won't have to worry about missing. Level Slash. Let's try to just finish this here. Alright, nice. MSP back. There we go. I honored you, my friend. Yep, figured. Alright, so if the way to go is that way, I'm gonna explore this back room first. Oh. Okay. Maybe it was just a back alley? They're skeletons. No, you can't handle it like gentlemen. Unless being gentlemen means letting them eat your flesh or something. I don't know. Skeletons eat flesh? Or they just tear you limb from limb because they hate the living because they're no longer living. It's better to go from the top.
And the luminescence should finish them. All right. Definitely good to have her have that extra SP. It's the cleric of the party. Oh, a large energizing pomegranate. Nice. Yeah, that was just a back alley. It didn't do anything different. Oh, what in the... What are those things? Sticky slugs. Let's see if they're weak to swords. Didn't think so. Probably spears. Maybe axes. Well, whatever. They're weak to luminescence. So that's good. Let's actually test out uh, arrows. Okay. How about axes? No. Swords? No. Staves? Good, I was hoping not. And spears? Probably... no. Uh, uh, spears, axe... I think I know what they're weak to. It's either this or elemental. Alright, it's this. Now that we know, everybody's powered up. I think a spear is best. It's a slug. A little sticky. Luminescence? Ooh. Ooh. It's not good. All weaknesses up. Oh, huh, actually. Let's see here. I don't know what that does, but I'm gonna go for... Oh, I'm just gonna capture it. Yeah. Regular capture. Blizzard. I think I'm just gonna capture it. So I'm gonna smack it a couple times. It'll probably be safe. From death. I did not need to power that up, but you know, might as well find out what it does. All right, old brick level. That's good. Energizing pomegranate. Yay! Stretch a little bit here. Spin it. Probably gonna. Call it soon here. What do I want to do? That doesn't tell me. All right. Oh, okay. You hit Y when you're not targeting anyone, and then it'll. What's this do? Red bile. This is the same thing, of course. That's just restore health. Sweeper pounce. Doesn't tell me what red bile does. Just tells me that's what it's called. Fire soul stone. It just goes back over here. Yes, yes. It was pointless to go the other way then. How good there's a priest.
No, we did finish it, nice. Smack one of them, hope you kill it. Didn't think so. Get some SP back. Right, one less to worry about. That's good. Just smack the rest. It's really nice that Cyrus has something to get HP back. Or not HP, SP. Well, he has HP too, but definitely not what I was talking about. If you know what movie I'm referencing, I will be very surprised. Because that was not a very good reference. Oh, there he is. I knew I heard him. No Cyrus leveled. I was not paying attention. Hit the puppet bones, I guess? A blizzard. No patience trigger? Alright. Ooh, second serving. There we go. Yeah, one that has 42.15. What do I need for the skills, anyways? Learn skills. 5,000, 5,000, 5,000. 3,000. There we go. Oh, 5,000 on the left. But we're attacking all foes. I think I'll save up for that, because even if I get Spearhead, I'm just going to be saving up for 5,000 anyways. What's the last thing you get? Oh, I can look here. Surpassing power. Oh wait, you have patience. Is it equipped? Great. Second serving, Eagle Eye increases the uh, equip character is critical. Uh, no, no. Drop that for patience. Yeah, that makes sense. Okay. Attacking first in battle, second serving, patience. Yeah, what's your physical attack without that? 
wanted to make sure I had the right, correct uh, 184 and with it 234 so yeah 50 that makes sense not really it seems slow for a hunter so yeah we're keeping some strength on yeah, there was a reason I put that on let's save here before I continue Oh, it's been almost a month. Oh, is this story? So he's basically seeking the Necronomicon? I do say, to think there was such elaborate structures under the surface. He's dead. What in the heavens is this? It's as if the blood was drained from his body. Where is this atop these strange patterns? Clearly, some baleful sorcery has been practiced here. These gemstones. Why, if my hypothesis is correct, they must be composed of crystallized human blood. Ugh. <laughs> and yet, it has a myriad hues of red are mixed together. Could it be that each gem contains the blood of multiple victims? Oh gods, what horrors have been wrought here? How many innocents have been victimized by this blood-sucking sorcerer? At least now we know the motive behind the kidnappings. The villain we are dealing with is no common criminal. No, I am loath to even call him a human being. Sucking... Sucking the life from the men and women of this poor town, only to cast them away. This is a veritable demon who walks among us. One thing is clear. This monster must be stopped before he can commit to any more vile deeds. As an academic, I must confess that the history of the Dark Arts intrigues me. But to put them into practice, this is truly beyond the pale. What's this? The young lady in the still, in, in this cell, she still lives. This cell, not this still. I must free her lest she suffer the same fate as the others. Still the cutscene. Who oh, knows? We've been found out. Just a scholar of no particular repute. I was passing through and could not help but notice these odd gemstones. Are they perhaps your work? And these strange glyphs, are they not runes of High Hornbergian? Are they now? Apparently his name is Gideon. The tomes of ancient Hornberg were lost long ago. No ordinary scholar would be privy to this knowledge. But Tolstoy he is prosperous, as he academic, performs such horrors. Ha <laughs> ha! Seems you're more of a scholar than you give yourself credit for. They still live, yeah? If you know what's best, you'll free them at once. Well, since you ask so nicely, no, I think not. A shame, if only you hadn't come poking 
around my secrets. I wouldn't have minded picking your brain. Now I'll have to settle for sucking your blood. Okay, then. I cannot fail. Can you phase? Uh, Lind, what do you think this guy's weak to? Swords. Good. I'm gonna guess he's weak to holy magic. Oh, surprise! He is. Then just smack him. Oh, for the love of. Pete. No, we're going to analyze Gideon first, get that last tidbit there. What is that? Oh, you can't... can't even see it. Hold on. Oh, axes. Okay, see, I needed to see it on the smaller s screen so I could tell what that was. Just looked like a triangle. Which is weird, normally you don't need to see it on the smaller screen. Let's see. He's attack them. And again. Oh, another! Oh. Alright, Lind. No? Okay, they're not weak spears either. Let's try. Ice Wind. No, okay. Well, I know you're weak to holy magic, so we're going to start doing that. Victory shall be mine. Axes. Alright, sweet. Now that I know that they're weak to axes, I'm going to full power haunt its attack. With axe on oh, that one. Oh, wow. Well, it wasn't fire, so let's try blizzard here. No? Alright. Worth a try. Heal more. Okay, I can't do that, but I can Thousand Spears. And let's try Lightning Blast. I'm not weak to that either, okay. Did I try Fire? I don't know. Never, let's take it out. Yeah, I can use the X. Nice. Uh, he doesn't summon any more yet. I'm sure he will. No, oh, he's by himself. Holy light. No X. All right, there we go. Fla. Two SP. Nice. Let my arrow fly. I don't know what's better on you. Oh, I can't tell in battle, so we'll just smack you. That one. Hey, what weapon is Cyrus using? Oh, my bad. Oh, yeah, I want to use this. He's dealing more damage with the... Oh, well. You can hold on to those for now. The 
battle here. Hands of darkness. Well then, that wasn't nice. Again on her next turn. There's no point to use skills, is there? Well, might as well use them. Deals more damage than the axe. Need some uh, SP back, thank you. Thank you, thank you. Any patience trigger? No, okay. gonna heal more how much does that thief skill cost six heal more cost 25 we'll have 12 left okay smack him I guess Oh, they both have patience. Nice. Means I can do some extra damage. Oh, I didn't mean to... Oops. Use that one. Okay. Might as well. Battle is here. Okay, well, I got back more than I used, at least. Okay, planning on just destroying him next round. Alright, they all survived. Okay, 
Oh, I didn't mean to... Ugh. I'm just so used to grabbing the bigger one there. Uh, cast by a single that usually targets all foes will instead of focus on a single foe at increased intensity. Can I cast that on himself? In case he's the enemy survives? Looks like he does. Hit him once with that. Let's hit him with some good old fire. Yeah, that gets pretty powerful too. <laughs> it's nice. Some level ups involved. Good. On it's not quite at 5,000 yet. Uh, they're still alive after all. No, I can't move yet. What in the? What's this? It couldn't be a copy of From the Far Reaches of Hell. Well, that's unfortunate. It's but an abridged copy, translated into the modern tongue. Aside but from basic instructions on performing the rites and the reagents required, all other details have been all but omitted. Why, it doesn't even mention the possible uses of these blood crystals. Just... Hmm. What's this? piece of parchment has been inserted between the pages. Calculations on the number of test subjects required to create one blood crystal. I see. There's a note. First specimen successfully synthesized and delivered. Delivered? Could it be that someone commissioned that frightful stone? We can only speculate. But could whoever is behind this be connected to the stolen tome I seek? Where... where am I? Ah, oh, you're back with us, good miss. I... I'm feeling... The drugs that awful man gave you are still affecting you. Pray rest until your strength returns. Who, who are you? Excuse me. Next question, my dear, and one I'd be more than happy to answer. Wooing a poor girl just awakened from a coma. Have you no shame? Come. <laughs> Don't be silly, silly Odette. He's merely trying to be a gentleman. <laughs> Clearly. Now then. At any rate, Odette, there is a favor I would ask of you. <sighs> Another one? Note my complete lack of surprise. I found on our kidnapper's person an abridged translated copy of From the Far Reaches of Hell. You're kidding. I accidentally skipped that one early, but that's fine. Needless to say, this could be a tremendous lead. I need to find out where and by whom the volume was translated. Let me have a look. Wah, wah, wah. Whoever bound this spared no expense. Indeed. Thought the same. There are a few bookmarkers in the realm that could produce such a tome. Bookmakers, not markers. 
Fine, I'll help. You have my thanks, apparently. Might remember the line one way and then have him say it in another in the text. Eureka! Did you find something? The thin yet steady pages are characteristic of paper made from the finest pine wood. While the texture of the vivid red binding reveals it as unmistakably tanned lambskin. Hmm. There is only one place in the realm where both can be found in sufficient quantities. Which means that... Stone guard. I am quite certain of it. So, that's where you will travel. Yes. Where else? I must track down this tome, Odette. I must do so before any more horrors can be unleashed upon our fair realm. I, see. I wasn't asking, you know. More like stating the obvious. Oh, travel banter. Really? Care not to boast, but have an experience in hunting wild goats. Oh, now that's interesting. Their fur and hide are highly valued, especially when unmarred by wounds. Instead of using a bow, I often build traps when I hunt goats. Build I traps when I hunt the goats. I see. I stalk the quarry, then herd it toward my pit or snare until it is caught. Different means for different prey. Hunting is not as simple as it seems. In all things, thou must find in the proper way to achieve in thy goal. Wouldst thou eat in soup with a fork? Steak with a spoon? Excellent examples both. You state your case most persuasively. You have a talent for teaching. Perhaps it is something you might pursue in the future. Me, a teacher, I think not. You seem very sure about that. I prefer the hunt. Well, pedagogue's loss is hunting's gain, I dare say. Pedagogues? Pedag okay. <laughs> okay, let's uh, save. Go back to the sewers, because I definitely missed stuff down there. Okay, I don't have to leave quite yet. Oh, I can't go back. At least not during uh, the... Maybe I can go back in after this cutscene. You're still here. I am, but not a moment longer. Thank you for everything, Odette. I am in your debt. You have quite a little here. What say we call it even? Be safe, Silas. I have a hunch you're poking around in something far more sinister than either of us can imagine. I am well aware of the danger. I will exercise due caution. <laughs> due caution? I believe it once you put diving headfirst into whatever you think smells of mystery. A man cannot so easily change his God-given disposition. You said it was 15 years ago that the tome was stolen. That I did. What of it? As you may recall, the then headmaster of the academy died under mysterious circumstances. That very same year. And you believe the two incidents are connected somehow? No. I just Spoken valedictory trivia, but now that you mention it, the disorder following the incident would offer a convenient opportunity to misappropriate an article from the archives, wouldn't you say? Your insight is invaluable and appreciated. I will 
Keep this in mind. I need not silence. Be careful, my friend. I will, and I'll return as soon as I get to the bottom of this. You have my word. I'll be waiting with bells on. I was expecting a farewell, like, uh, aside from her, but I guess we can focus on the hooded figure that was overhearing the conversation. Sure, why not? And so, Cyrus did... did... And so, Cyrus bid Quarry Crest farewell. The translated volume he recovered from the villain, pointing him to his next destination, Stone Guard, in the Highlands where the original copy of the tome he sought surely lies. Cyrus forged on in search of the truth. And so, we continue our journey. Oh, more travel banter. Is something troubling you, my friend? You suddenly have a worried look about you. Don't stop and don't look back, but I feel eyes upon us. Someone watching, you mean? Hmm. It would well behoove us to trust your instincts. The question is, who? Let us drag them out of hiding and find out. Compel them to confess their intentions. We could try, but if they escape, we will only have served to alert them. Then only one other avenue is open to us. What would that be? Continue on our way, pretending that we have noticed nothing, and let them make the first move. If that be your advice, so be it. But you must be our lookout. Do not let your guard slip. <laughs> Knowing one's enemy is the first step to defeating him. I cannot tell if you are courageous or ignorant of the danger. Let me go in. Please let me go in. Thank you. I will round out this episode by opening chests. Hee 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 hee. He 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 Wario. I need the money. It's a mine. No, Wario. It's a mine. No, it's a mine. Blittered him. I use a blittered. Okay. Why do I keep doing that? Oh well, I hit them. I was hoping to kill them that turn. I obviously did not. Six is um, not enough. I'll try. Nice. For no other reason than I removed it from battle. Smack these things a little bit. I'm gonna see what the beast actually does. Red bile. 
Reduces his magic resistance. That's really good with this party. So we have all these guys chapter two done. Counting chapter one as the recruitment stage. So chapter two is done for all of these guys. All right, you don't have any points left. Smack some things with you. Guess I'll find out next time what uh, things I can do. I really like the battle music in this game. <laughs> oh, yikes. Oh, I have a healing great bunch. I had more than one, but I'm using one of them. Getting distracted by the music. SP to do anything more than that. Hmm, she actually hit every time. Let's see, Axe. Go, nice shields. Smacky smack smack, that's next. Take it down, though. You may not be made for such battles, but you're not doing bad either, so I mean, whatever. Okay, so there's a save here, which leads me to believe that there's more by a lot in this dungeon. Uh, I think we'll pick that up next time then. Going for almost two hours, yeah. Um, well, uh, thanks for watching. I hope you like this, liked this episode. Uh, actually, got two story segments done. One of the ones that I've already gotten through, like what, two thirds of it before in a previous episode, and then one that was shorter than I thought it would be. So that's not bad. Um, we're gonna finish exploring the sewers and then maybe recruit someone else. Maybe go on to some continue someone's story i'm not sure yet but uh thanks for watching